Hi there. So welcome back to the stream for today. So it's been a long time we came your way for issues on financial accounting. And as we have heard, the students are about to write the exams. We want to expose our students to some of the basic principles, some of the things that they need to know when it comes to financial accounting. And today I want to discuss a key one of the fundamental key topics in financial accounting, which is on incomplete records and single entry, as one of the corrective accounting issues that, as an accountant, you should be able to work. I mean, work it, all, work it out and then provide or produce what a financial statement, because issues on incomplete records, single entry, are where the details for preparation of financial statement is not complete. So as a good accountant, you should be able to look at the information and then redraft everything and then have a correct word, financial statement. So that's what we're going to look out for in today's word section. So we're going to take this question as a way to explain concepts for you to appreciate that. So this question is one of the practice questions for us to go generally there. So as we move on, if you have any question, drop in there comment section for us to go and make sure to like and share the video so that others will always get the benefit to join us. So the question goes like, the accountant has found the following details of transaction for J. Frank's shop for the year ended 31st December 2023. So we have transaction A up to E and we have what information for previous year and then current year, and we have, we are asked to prepare or required to A, draw up a statement of affairs at the beginning of the period, then B, prepare the cash book for the period C, prepare income statement for the year ended 31st December 2023, and then D, prepare a statement of financial position as at 31st December 2023. So this question say, 20 marks as I have allocated for this. Let's see how we can go through and see how we can answer some of these questions. Should in case we likely to meet some of these questions in our examination. So first of all, we are asked to prepare what statement of affairs. So statement of affairs is a snapshot of what the whole affairs of the entity. So it's more like what it's similar to what balance sheet but it doesn't give an official presentation it just what a snapshot just an extract of the financial statement that we prepare for us to know the opening and closing capital of what the business that is the statement of affairs or the balance sheet generally there so let's go with a we are asked to prepare what or draw a statement of affairs so we will have a, before even we do that, we need to have the name of the company, or the name of the business, sorry. So in this case, also J. Frank Shop. So you have that written there at the first instant. So J. Frank, J. Frank, what? Shops. Okay. So that's the first thing you want to what, do. That's the first thing you want to do, generally there. 